changing your style. You start using your corner. It's like, you gotta trust the system, right? So he opened it up and he started using the corner. It's midway. So this is that side, who wants to do the other side? And then we start to flick it. Because you need all that space to create that, that blend, that transition. Okay? Now from here, <laughs> that's how I move my clipper, just like that. Remember, so for example, the inch to me is that. So from here to here. Focus on down here being the cutting teeth. Okay, that's lighting up now. What happens is if you try to put a hard line on the recession area without keeping the other side in mind, you're going to have to match it up to that. So you have to bring everything up higher than you really need to. Does that make sense? And here's the thing about this hair. You see how this hair is combing that way? That isn't necessarily his hairline. We have to be able to think, say, the hairline from bangs or from hangover. So his hairline is wherever the follicle starts, which is about right here. Okay? Now, we can use this hangover to our advantage to create the illusion that his hairline is smaller, right? So let's see what we can do. You want. You want a slanted angle. Because if you go straight down, when you look at him from a front profile, it won't look square. It'll look like a hexagon. As it dries, you'll see uh, some pretty sick uh, texture. Wait till it starts air drying, you'll really start seeing it. Medium and long is the combination of the sea salt spray, that's what's creating this texture and separation. So we're running behind, we got 20 minutes to eat lunch. Dre's mad. Look at him. Look at Dre. Life is good. He's not going to be a Debbie Downer to me. So I open the door to put my book bag down and this man Fonz hops in the car. How does that make you feel? I ain't your driver. I'm driving, but I'm not your driver. Oh. You know what? Just drive. Ring finger here. Now you have some more stability. 
Okay? Sorry. Don't cut yourself. Now you good money. How's that feel? Okay, if that doesn't feel good, then check this out. The next finger here, middle, or uh, thumb. Just like this. You can hold it closer if you want. See this? Try that. <laughs> Slide this over. Slide this over. Does that feel better? Mm -hmm. Alright, thug life. Let's do it. Don't cut them. Don't be a thug. I mean, don't cut them. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Okay. You want to make sure you're going against the grain at all times, right? So, what you need to do is lower him because you're shorter. Okay. Have him to his head back. Now. Grab, grab the skin, pull it, right? Pay attention to the back of the blade. If you have to go like this, move that finger. Move this oh, this finger. one? Yep. You can use the back of the blade, like mm -hmm. this. Okay. See that? Mm -hmm. And then as you get here, then you can start using the corner until you make the shape. Okay. Okay? Let's mm -hmm. try this. How many times do you have Just the one. Um, you, gotta, you gotta be committed, girl. It's so. just a weird holding hand. Okay, watch this. Look how I do it. Doesn't have to be weird. Boom, I placed the blade on there. Nice, committed strokes. See that? Okay. And then here. Now you have this little corner and you sketch it. You gotta practice this. Okay. Can be the only one to shot not using the razor. Right, I'm gonna let you have that, by the way. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Should we do it outside with the sign and everything? Let's do it outside. Alex, you want to come out, out with us real quick? Yeah. Hey man, I just want to give a special thanks to Alex at End Endless Barbershop, man, for having us, for hosting. On a day he was supposed to be open. My man was supposed to be open today and he shut down the shop to get back to the community out here to kind of, you know, for continued education, man. So, bro, like out of everybody that's hosted this, I really, it really means a lot because I thought you guys were closed already. So for you to guys to close the shop, man, in order to have this class, man, it means a lot to me. So I want to thank you. If you guys haven't been to the shop, come check it out. Obviously, this is somebody who you want to work with. If you're looking for a barbershop or anything, a team to grow with, this is obviously somebody who's all about growing. And if you see inside the shop, man, they got a bunch of um, bottles too. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm going to make my first guy run by over here. I'm going to drop it. I like the way his hair is falling into his occipital bone, so we, we should keep that on. It allows us to keep that silhouette to that shape. And so I'm just gonna start detailing this blend. I'm gonna do some scissor work over here. on the top up so I mean unless it looks it looks like it needs to be smoothed out when I'm done with the sides I, don't really need to. I cut every texture of hair pretty much the same if I'm going against the grain I'm really using all the steps that I 
told you guys about? Just fasting. The same technique you showed me earlier? Yeah, same technique. It has been about 12 minutes. Nah, man, did you guys learn anything Cheers. today? Bro, I've been here 14 hours. I endured a lot. Thank you, man. <laughs> Jose's the MVP. He's been, like, he been with me for 20, 20 something hours. Last finishing touch, you turn him in the mirror and you just start coasting. Make sure your client can see that you're coasting. Yeah, man, this dude's really putting in the work. Mm -hmm. Man, this dude right here is special. Yeah, we're going to get his uh, 360, man. Tell him I'm going to be running for his money. <laughs> no, I'm playing. <laughs> Bro, that dude got some nasty waves, man. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, thank you guys for coming, man. I appreciate it. Hope you guys learned something. Hey, people, hey. Just real quick, man. I just want to give some feedback from the, the Look and Learn course and the hands-on course I did with Chris Baggio here in Dallas. Phenomenal. Phenomenal, man. I, I, I expected nothing less, and I got a lot out of it. My face went from here to here in 12 hours. You only get out what you put in. And Chris is a, a great, great, great teacher. Maybe the best teacher I've ever seen in the barber game, man. The guy is real. His work is real, you know, so I, uh, thanks to them, thanks to Dre, th thanks to Fonz, man. I got I got to talk to Fonz a lot, man. Uh, you know, everybody cool, man. They all just like Chris, uh, down to earth people, you know, humble. And, and what more can you ask, man? So, you know, if you got the time and the money, man, I recommend this course. You know, Chris hooked me up with a, with a nice fade. Yeah. <laughs> get there. Get there. You have to. Chris Baggio, man. I love it. I love you, man. I love y'all's people. Keep it up.